Good afternoon, my audience. My name is Merja Taipalemäki. I present City Nomadi. Uh, we have four business segments by visualizing information and interactivity on maps. We do cities, including tourism in cities, uh, buildings, including indoors position, uh, environment, including tourism in nature, environmental issues, and gaming, including well-being and um, uh, education. I have here a study uh, customer case uh, for one museum in my hometown where we made an indoor location service. So, usually the indoor maps are very fuzzy, as you can see. So, uh, on our application, there is a lot of benefits. We can uh, serve the visitors with additional information, additional language uh, possibilities, also um, regarding accessibility but also uh, a lot of interactive media during the exhibition. And also they are aware where they, have, they are in a, for example, museum uh, and what they should see. So you can have, for example, um, recommendations there. Um, here you can see that we have um, language variations. You can see some of the interface which can be tailored according to the user segments, and um, we have a lot of on our research and development pipeline. So at the moment, we are in business with mature product, but um, we are very aware that this is a fast, uh, forward-moving business. So we are really doing everyday work in developing our, our service. So, um, you can actually use our uh, concept for different kinds of um, activities very cost efficiently. And, um, well, I can ask the further questions. Thank you. Thank you. Um, do you so, can you please just explain if all of the different attractions um, are housed in your app or if you're building as a white label, your solution to different museums and attractions and so forth? Um, our clients are free to choose from. Um, if they choose ones. our application, it's cheaper. Yes. It's easier, it's quicker. If they want to have a white label application, um, it's their choice. We make it uh, in a very cost efficient way again. Uh, but then they get their brand, they can use their brand, their visual. Um, um, what, whatever they want to have there. So if I understand correctly, you're going both direct to consumer and then also like a B2B type model for, to, to, for the white label? Yes, actually we work B2B, but um, if you want it to be exact, it could be B2B to B2C to yeah. or B2B to B2E to e because actually now we are looking for new um, segments for building industry, real estate management, et cetera, et cetera, where this um, information and service could be provided for the people who are maintaining the premises or are working within the premises, like in hospitals. How large can this business uh, can become? Is it a 10 million US dollar business per year if, if, you're, if you're scale? Well, actually, um, we, our income is quite modest at the moment. Uh, we are looking for investment to, be, uh, to grow up um, and to, to um, spread the operations and marketing um, because we are able to act globally. Uh, there is no problem. We, we use global maps. We can also use the government maps and, and local maps. But um, actually, the uh, problems are similar everywhere. Okay.